And it was a very exciting weekend in sports for all of the highlights. Now we turn to Sunny Yang with the sunny side of sports. So, Sunny, I hear that there was an exciting development in track and field. And when we talk about that, I think of Kenya, you know? You think right, Vincent. Very exciting development in Berlin over the weekend. Here's a sunny side of sports salute for David Rudisha, Kenya's new world record holder at 800 meters. David clocked one minute, 41.09 seconds to break the 13-year-old record held by another Kenya-born athlete, Wilson Kip Kutur. Now, David Rudisha is part of a proud athletic family. His father, Daniel, won a silver medal for Kenya in the 4x400 meter relay at the 1968 Olympics in Mexico City. But let's go back to Berlin at that same meet in Germany. South Africa's Castor Semenya won the women's 800 meter race. Castor clocked 1 minute 59.90 seconds. It was the third race for Semenya in her comeback. Our In Focus viewers will remember she took about a year off because of a gender controversy, but she's now back in action. Now let's go to Dar es Salaam, Tanzania, and the tall basketball player I've nicknamed the Tanzanian tree topper, Hashim Tabit, recently returned home to Dar es Salaam, and he conducted a basketball clinic for about 500 boys and girls in Tanzania. Basketball is growing in Tanzania. There is a premier league in the country, and Hashim Tabit is part of that development, conducting a clinic for Tanzanian children. Finally, in tennis, Roger Federer, the Swiss star, successfully defended his title at the Cincinnati Masters Tournament in Ohio. Federer warming up for next week's U.S. Open in New York. It was Roger Federer's 63rd career title as a professional. I'm VOA Sonny Young, and that's the sunny side of sports. Back to Demi and Vincent. Well, mm. thank you very, very much, Sonny. Remember, viewer, to watch for the sunny side of sports every Monday and Friday right here on In Focus.